creating a new preset in Absinthe 5. It's a metallic crystal uh, type sound with some motion in it. And I'm using Absinthe 5's new cloud filter, which is a filter type that uh, does granular delay. And I'm using sample content. And here's a little tip uh, when you're using something like Ableton Live. You're creating original harmonic content all the time if you're using freeze tracks. Every time you freeze a track, you're putting uh, waveform data onto your hard disk. So if you go to the folder, you know, your Ableton folder, samples, processed, freeze, that's a gold mine of uh, harmonic content that you can use for creating new sounds. So I, I grabbed a waveform from a pad from a song I'm working on. And I've actually done quite a bit of work on this preset, but I'll just sort of share some of the mechanics of what I'm doing with this preset and where I'm going with it. So here's the preset with just a, here's that waveform with just a bit of filter on it, I played across the keyboard. And I've made a copy of the oscillator and filter and put it in oscillator A in the end. I switch to the new cloud filter, and so here's the difference. You can hear the granular uh, delay effect. And of course everything sounds better with effects on it, so I have a pipe effect. Which gives it a lot more uh, reverb and ambience. And if I add in the original, it's a little warmer. But let's add some more rhythmic quality to this. I'm going to, uh, if, if you right click on per, a lot of the parameters, there's a convenience menu that lets you do things like create envelopes. So I'm going to go ahead and modulate the output of oscillator one, which is the one that has all the sparkle and granular grit on it. And I'm going to use one of the templates. I'm going to go with eighth notes. Actually, I'm going to instead use rhythmic eighth notes. So now when I play oscillator one is modulated by that envelope and we turn oscillator two off just so we can hear it. I'm going to bring this in just a little more. Go back to the envelope. And I want the the crystalline sort of sound to die off so I'm going to change the tail end of this envelope. All right, so it's broken crystals in progress. So that's some of the new features in Absinthe 5. I just started playing around with some of them, uh, and I really like this cloud filter. It does add a lot of sparkle and character.